Because I enjoy building things, my wife got me this hand-cranked music machine by Smartivity. It was great. The laser cut pieces came apart very nicely. The instruction manual had large pictures, very clear instructions, one of the best I'd ever seen. I had a lot of fun putting it together. This is a great father-son uh, project. There's just one problem. And that problem you can hear is that it doesn't strike all the notes. Now that's supposed to be jingle bells. What's happening is that the end of these arms are triggered by these pins. And if there are two or more pins in a row, the first pin lifts the arm, but before the arm can fall and make a note, the second pin catches it. The first thing I tried to solve this problem was I thought that maybe there was too much drag between the armatures and the little guides here. So I took the machine apart, sanded it all down, took all the sharp edges off, and then coated it with some dry Teflon lubricant. That didn't help. The next thing I did was add a small binder clip to the end of each armature, thinking that the extra weight would help these fall fast enough so that all the notes would be played. It helped a little, but not much. While I was doing that, I noticed that at one point, I kind of pressed down on this guide piece here, and it started playing better. And that gave me the idea that if I could change the angle, the armatures might clear the pins faster, and all the notes would be played. So I mounted the machine on a board, put a shim under the leading edge, and then a couple of screws in front of the guide board here, and slowly tighten them down to curve this base so that the angle of the end of the armatures was a little bit shallower than it was before. This helped. What it did is it allowed the armature to slip off of the first pin uh, before the second pin could catch it. Now you can avoid all of this by turning the crank very, very slowly so that the armatures have time to get off all the pins. The trouble is this was made for children and children don't like to go slow. So if you have one of these and you're not happy with it not hitting all the notes, try these modifications and I think you'll find it helps. Thanks for watching.